I find that this stadium being so hard to win and get points away against Pittsburgh, getting the, the first goal is going to be key to them having success. However, we know that this Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh team is a never say die mentality. Has to be very careful now for the remainder of the game. Early set piece for the Hounds. Driven into the penalty area, the header is wide from Joey Farrell. That wasn't That's far away at all. Griffin whips this ball in delightfully, just leaves it there at the near post to be attacked. He does ever so well to get his head on that Farrell, but just guides it inches wide at the post, but that's a huge let for new. Forbes, header snap down and nearly for Dequa. Win out, or they take care of Tampa Bay, really. That game in St. Pete carries a lot of weight. Rivas got to this, and his angle tightening, knocked down by Jamali Waite. Forbes, header down and in! Joey Farrell! What a dynamic, darting header to put Pittsburgh ahead! Corner kick for Pittsburgh, and they absolutely punish. There's been two or three deliveries that are coming in the air, and Farrell has been absolutely magnificent at attacking the ball. And here he does what he does best, near post area. He doesn't even need to put much power onto this delivery. He just guides it on frame, and the ball does the at one of the hardest places to come away and take away points from in, in the USL Championship. Now their metal is going to be tested as, as both a team and as an individuals. They've now got to go and chase this game. Quantum Spirits corner kick. The Riverhounds header in again! Oh! Arturo Donez! Two perfect headers have the Riverhounds two goals ahead! For Pittsburgh, two goals. And before that, there were a couple of warning signs, but again, Forbes have a great delivery here. But just look how high Arturo gets up above everybody else. He's inches, there's nobody close to him, and he buries this into the back of the net. Again, just using the pace of the ball from Canado Forbes. Beautiful delivery, doesn't need to do anything apart from... They have six foot players in there who are great at attacking these deliveries. Forbes hangs it up off the crossbar, he did it again! Farrell rose to the occasion. Now, let's see the corner kick first. Forbes again, beautiful delivery. It's Farrell again. He but Griffin, some lovely skill here on the left-hand side right now. The final delivery wasn't that good, but he did so well to beat two and three players in the box. They've got a little bit of everything, this Pittsburgh team. They have your rugged players who are going to do the hard work and hold the ball up. Earlier this year in that Open Cup game, I don't know if you saw the news this week that the goal scored by Alvaro Barreal got nominated for the Puskas. FIFA World Goal of the Year. Oh, yeah? <laughs> One of eight. Which obviously puts them in a great position for the playoffs. I just spoke to another coach earlier this week that said the time for rotation for its sake is over. Hurst, tight angle, ripped it off the bar. And back out the other way. He, he does well here to let this ball run across his body. Great steal there. The through pass, the run, the timing. But the longer it runs, the angle gets tighter. It's really going to have to be something special. But it, it is with Pittsburgh briefly. Hurst able to knock it back. And here goes Moreno. He's fresh to start the half. Played that all the way through. Wait the save. And cleared away before Wait was called upon again. Moreno, if he's able to bring this to the table, you question why he didn't start this game. That's a great delivery. Rivas is in a great area. He really should be putting that back into the, into the back of the net and giving his team a chance in this game. Keeper does ever so well wait here to stay big until the lock. Charleston for the three. It might be why they failed to get a home game. Dequa. Dequa! Thomas. You know, for all the work Dequa does inside the 18, when he unleashes from there. Keeps possession. Then the through pass there, and Dequa looks around. He doesn't see anybody's pass through. And, he... and when you put it past King Kenny, get his trio of assists. Puts that in play. Dequa saved off the line. Nearly his 18th. Stabbed down by Ordonez and cleared away. I thought he was going for the Olympico here. Where it's a dime onto Dequa's head. He hits it in the one place. He heads it into the one place where Bailey's on the line to clear it away. Anywhere else, and that's in the back of the net. Dequa will be kicking himself there. He could have got the goal to put him ahead in the golden boot race. And his chance creation hasn't dropped at all. 
He's aged like a fine wine. Dished out by Dequa Rivera. Sends early. Thumbs up from Dequa. As the ones who are starting the game, because at some point in the season or in the playoffs, you're going to need those ones. Stridently forward, ball blasted Mertz. He nearly scored in back-to-back -back games off the bench. We genuinely saw something really special tonight. Mertz. Oh, they've all got it figured out. That's wide by Deke while the whistle had already gone. And that golden boot race. Hard to tell from this out. Portillo, he's a danger from here. Finds Yearwood. Is he pointing for a handball? Oh, I told you not to turn over yet. There's going to be more action in this game. And the referee gives certainty to the decision. Yeah, I think he's right. That's a lot closer to the angle that you'll see the referee have because he's basically standing equivalent to the penalty. Is the great dead ball specialist for New Mexico. Jamali Waite, the 24-year-old goalkeeper, awaits. Portillo scores. New Mexico is alive tonight. Game on here in Pittsburgh. Oh, what a finish. Into the side net in top corner. Gives weight no chance. Head and shoulders above anybody else on the field for height. If the delivery is right. Could 43 be looking for 49? Portillo was looking to be the hero. Shot at frame by Borgelin. I oh, saw a hand in there somewhere. Full time, it's over. Pittsburgh has secured a home playoff game for the first time in five seasons.